Okay, I finished the fan portion of the Hemotep Radiant Oscillator Light, and uh, I put it in a smaller box and I named it the Snack Box. This is the Lid Motor Snack Box, and it's the Bedini fan that goes with the light. And uh, I wanted something I could put on the boat that would be fairly waterproof and that would hold everything, so I wanted to put the whole the whole thing in a box. So I did. So anyway, that's the lid motor snack box Bedini fan. And it's all uh, it's all in here. The fan, the internal batteries, and the connector cords to the lunch box. And I've got cords that run back to the to the lunch box so that I can use not only the power in the lunch box but the circuitry and that's what I found really neat about what happened here was I was able to take the circuitry especially the pulsar circuit and use the cat pulsar circuit with this circuit this is a standard Bedini uh, SSG circuit and of course it's uh, hooked up to this fan that the Emotip uh, gave a real good description on how to build a fan into the John Bedini SSG circuit. But anyway, this uh, this thing runs on internal batteries and uh, it's a um, real nice little fan. It's got a, an adjuster here for fan speed so you can rev it up or down. And I just have a little trim knob here for doing the trim on the transistor, and that's the emergency light that if you don't have the charge battery hooked up, that'll glow and protect the transistor from being burned out. But these things here, in conjunction with the circuitry in the um, lunch box, the Emotip Radiant Oscillator Light lunch box circuitry, especially with the cap pulsar, was really, really neat. Now what I'm going to do is turn this off here. It's going to stop. And I'm going to plug this into the lunch box. This is the charge port over here on the side where if you were charging an external battery, uh, this is where you'd plug it in. That's the trimmer for the um, cap pulser there. Now I'm going to plug in on the other side here. I'm going to plug in the drive for the fan right where the drive would go in for an external power source. Now right now I've got it in a wall outlet. I'm going to unplug it here so it's all on its own now. This is all internal batteries. This is the whole step back here. I'll show you the whole setup here. That's all internal batteries right there. Okay. There's a CFL, modified CFL. There's the Emotip Radiant Oscillator Light with all the circuits that you've seen in the other videos. And then this little snack box uh, Bedini fan hooked up to it. Now what I'm going to do here is I'm going to turn on the light first. Okay, there goes the light, and that's running on the um, solid state circuit, running through the ignition coil, and of course the cap pulsar is going now. And it's got internal batteries that are being charged with the cap pulsar. And uh, all of these uh, trimmers and rheostats adjust the circuitry inside that box. Now what I'm going to do now is I'm going to turn on the... Um, Bedini fan just by doing that to it. Okay, now there goes the Bedini fan. Now I have this turned off right here because I'm taking power straight from the box. If I turn this switch on, I found out, I overload these batteries and uh, I actually just about had a meltdown because I'm running higher voltage batteries in there than I am in this box here. So you have to be careful when you do this that you don't... Uh, cause a heating problem with your batteries. But anyway, there it's going. Now I've got the uh, the Bedini fan running here and I can make that go up or down with the speed control. The, the light's going. Everything's really, really cool here. But watch this. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn off the lunch box. And there's the light. There's the cap pulsar. This is running on the Bedini circuit. And I found that very, very interesting, is that this will run um, 
together. These things are compatible and they run together. I can actually take all the batteries out of that box completely, take everything out, and it will run at 32, I'm sorry, 320 milliamps draw everything. Everything will run with um, 320 milliamps, the fan and the light at that brightness. Anyway, that's the latest project here. That's my Emotif radiant oscillator light with the um, added Bedini fan, all the circuits working together, and that's my little snack box.